谢谢公司，谢谢公司。Okay. Ready? Yes. <laughs> wow, very sweet.
sign is so talkative, you know. Oh, you go all around and ask up to everybody. And you, you got suspicious uh, something about this boy we don't know. So, <coughs> we began to realize that, you know, what he was presenting to us was not real. So we, one of the favorite things that the manager like to do is to embarrass him. So do I have to
thank the Lee family for the performance. Next up, I would like to invite Jeff. But probably it's because of the amount of KSU I've eaten. Uh. That's why my size is like that. Okay, so um, first of all, I've known Seth for about 10 years and uh, while I can't remember clearly how we met, right, he actually claimed that he did. Okay, so it was through a mutual friend called Sean. So one day he was playing pool with Sean and suddenly Sean told Seth, Hey bro, later I'm going to introduce you the biggest guy you ever seen in your whole life. And his name is Chiki. So imagine Seth right, being so small size and a friend telling him that, Oh, you, you meet the biggest guy ever you've seen and his name is the name of a mascot. Then uh, imagine what Seth would think, right? So when I first walked into the pool place, right, then he started to burst out laughing. Okay, his passion and commitment will assure you that in the baddest of situations, right, that we will pull through it together as what the team crafters have did for the past one and a half years. <laughs> Seth has been very influential and uh, very connected to his friends and will make you talk if he feels that something is amiss. He will make the effort to text the guy and also meet, meet us up at the expense of our convenience. And uh, he's a very simple person and care a lot. Oh, but I tell you, this girl is damn solid. Okay? <laughs> she is super straightforward, very upfront, and very truthful. She'll be bold and say things like, Wow, Chiki, you are getting fatter. Please do something about it. Okay? And you know how this uh, fat shaming is a very huge thing, right? People go on the road to protest about it. But this girl just yelled it right in my face. Okay? So. Well, Seth and I weren't friends yet to witness his jaw-dropping experience uh, when he first met Tiang. I saw how he fought the long waiting battle to win Tiang's heart for, for almost three years. And that was the first time I actually seen Seth being the happiest man on the staircase and he, he cried for three full hours, resenting himself. But that's is when I know that uh, when a man is so broken over a woman, right, you, you know that he loves her more than anything else. Both of you may not know, but I'm actually super impressed of the both of you because uh, both of you have actually found the perfect Mr. Right, Mr. and Mrs. Right for each other and as a good friend, I couldn't be more happy than for the both of you. Your love story is actually an epitome. Uh, on behalf of the group, I'd like to thank Tiang and Seth for the awesome. occasion and I know that both of you have been putting a lot of effort and hard work to making this night and the church and care wedding to be possible and uh, really everything has went well and it has been amazing. I wish the both of you a long and happy marriage and I know that you will both make each other happy and you guys are everything that each other needs. Right, thank you. Thank you for the speech, Chiki. Can I invite the next speaker, Yen Ting? That I didn't have time to practice my script at all. So this is actually done pretty last minute. Uh, let me just try to undo this. Uh, Okay, so I want to start off by thanking you all for making this trip for the chosen one to be her, Jiang Yi's me. Yeah, Jiang and I have been through a lot together and I love that I was actually a part of her journey here. So we met in uh, our secondary school. We we're never classmates and never even like CCA mates. She's from Ben and from Netball. And we just make friends like this always been. And that's just raise our glass and us them to Seth and Jiang. So we invite the group brother, Rong Shan. Hello everybody. Yeah, I say I'm a bit shy. I'm a, you know, from a young boy to a fine young man now. And there's this thing about Seth, right? That never changed until now. You know, okay, I've been saying, yeah, I've been saying for the past 10 years that you want to join a gym and become a really fit, but now he still looks the same to me. Uh. Uh, you're supposed to laugh. Uh. <laughs> okay. So, nice but, and hairy, you know. Um, and then she go overseas, she'll buy this for my baby. You know, and she's very nice to my baby. You know. But she doesn't like it for me and my wife. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so to Seth and Sally, um, have a baby marriage and please have a baby room soon. Uh. <laughs> okay, thank you, thank you. I mean, 
since we went up school together, so we actually know each other for about 10 years. So I think I'm one of the rare few that actually known them since they first knew each other. Because we were classmates. As well as our table were there, definitely. So Mm, I remember 10 years yeah. ago. Then mm, I spent the last few days after that and then trying to text Jai and ask her to be welcome subsequent to that. And I don't really remember what happened during that period already. <laughs> but, but for these past 10 years, I actually seen how, and for the past 8 years when they are together, I've seen how they are love blossom and how they actually found it for each other. Definitely there were times when you all quarrel and you come to me and then tell me about it. And <laughs> but I told her, I mean everything is difficult, but love is not easy to, like, to get together and all. So we actually help each other through when we both have problems with our relationship and we come running to each other crying <laughs> all the time. <laughs> yeah, so for me. <laughs> Thank you.